1924, Princess Marie Bonaparte was really upset because she was friends with Freud. And Freud said, a woman who has a vaginal orgasm is a mature woman. And if you can't have a vaginal orgasm, then you're immature and you're not woman enough. And she was really upset because she could get herself off, but her husband couldn't get her off. And he was the prince. And she was really, really frustrated. And she went up to her girlfriends and she was like, Hey girl, do you have the same issue? Do you come from sex? Because I come totally all good, all on my own. But when he does me, it doesn't last long enough and it's not touching your clit. So her girlfriends were like, Girl, I can't come either. She decided she would do this research project, but she had to use a pen name because after all, she was Napoleon's great grandniece. So she gathered up 234 women and she asked them all how they came, if they orgasmed easily from sex alone, if they could get themselves off, and then she measured the distance between their clitorises and their vaginal opening. And she called it the rule of thumb. So basically the, the short distance was the distance from the first knuckle of your thumb to the tip of your thumb that's usually about an inch. And they were called paraclitorines. I just call them paraclits. Like a parachute, but a paraclit. Um, and then the women with medium distance, which was exactly the one inch between the knuckle of the thumb and the tip of the thumb, those women were called mesoclitorines and mesoclits. And um, the women with a farther distance between their clitoris and their vaginas, those were called teleclits. So essentially, she realized that the closer the distance measurement was between the clitoris and the vagina, the easier it was for a woman to come. So she hypothesized that perhaps if she could move her clitoris closer to her vagina that she could maybe finally achieve the ultimate orgasm and be this mature woman that Freud had told everybody you had to be if you wanted to be a real woman. I mean, can you imagine if we told men today that to be a real man you had to have a mature G-spot orgasm and have a finger in your ass? Because, I mean, neglecting a man's prostate is kind of the same as neglecting a woman's clitoris, but you know, they get to be real men anyway. So she fell into the category of a teleclit. She went to this Austrian surgeon and she was like, hey bro, can you like move my clit closer to my vagina so I can finally have this mature woman orgasm? So he did the operation on Miss Marie. She had the operation done once. It was not a success. She had it done again, and then she finally figured out that the best way for her to have a penetrative orgasm from a dick being up in her badge was by sitting on her partner's lap face to face. That's how Marie Bonaparte got her boner part and learned how to become a complete woman. <laughs>